This video is to show 90 degree magnetic gearing, magnetic coupling. Um, this is some work that Lid Motor has been working on. I believe Professor Jones, I know Slider, probably several others. Uh, this is some pretty neat stuff that uh, I saw Lid Motor doing. So uh, I'm surprised this works at all. This is a uh, magnetically levitated rotor. And there are magnetic field lines just running everywhere with this. There's, there's magnets all over the place. This is a circuit. I believe I got this from Smart Creations. Uh, two transistors, a resistor, a couple of capacitors, and a single coil. And uh, that's turning that, that, that rotor there. Nothing connected to this rotor other than the magnetic field lines coming off of the first one. Now this one has a magnet on the bottom and the top, a little rotor suspended by a needle. And this thing's been uh, been running a couple of hours now. And uh, I just thought this was so neat. Uh, not brave enough to try all the, the experiments that Lid Motor has yet or uh, even some of the stuff that I've seen Slider do, but uh, I'll get there, but uh, very impressed. Now, I do know uh, strong magnets, very low resistance, seem to be the key to making this work. I, I played with this several hours to, to get it to this point, uh, but this is just pretty cool. Pretty cool. A little follow-up while while this is spinning just to show you that, uh, that in fact it, it is continuing to run. A little follow up from my emergency light project. Uh, thanks to several of you, you suggested uh, maybe I put in a way to uh, charge this from solar if uh, I ever lost grid power. And so I made myself a, uh, a little solar panel. This is uh, out of those little garden yard lights, little solar lights uh, that you can buy at the dollar store. I put a uh, DC plug in the top. In the full sunshine, that thing will put out uh, nine and a half volts and uh, a quarter of an amp, 250 milliamps. I, I'm real happy with that. I put a blocking diode so that if it puts out less than, uh, than the battery's carrying, it, it won't backfeed. And so that was just a fun little project. But here you can see, rotors are still spinning, haven't slowed down. So, uh, like I said, I'm surprised this thing is working at all with, with all the magnets I have in here. Uh, ring magnets, big, big button cell magnets, uh, just a, <laughs> a whole lot of stuff in there. But yet it still, still seems to uh, be coupling with this other little rotor and uh, spinning it quite well. So that's my update on this little project and uh, hope you enjoy it. Thanks.